Hello friends, I'm your friend Chetan Bhola and you are watching Bhola Moto. In this video, we will be discussing about engine coolant and uh, I will be touching each and every point regarding engine coolant. So please keep watching this video till the end. You are going to have a really good stuff in this video. So please keep watching this video till the end. And also, if you are new to the channel, please subscribe it right now. As the name only suggests engine coolant is used to cool the engine but why it is required to cool the engine so whenever the fuel burns in an engine only one third of the of its energy is actually used to move the vehicle but two third of uh, of this energy is wasted as heat and especially half of its heat energy is wasted to the surrounding and half is utilized in uh, heating the components so uh, this one sixth of this whole fuel energy will be heating the uh, components of the engine so if this uh, if it is not controlled this one sixth of the heat energy is not controlled then it will keep on increasing the temperature of the engine components and it will uh, be it, it will be heating these components until these components become red hot or actually seize the engine so that's why it is required to extract the heat from these components so that they they may not get seized so uh, there comes a the need of engine coolant so basically uh, previously the engine coolant as an engine of the water is used they tried to use water but what they found is that uh, very very frequently water get boiled and uh, in some in some time of the winter season the uh, water get free frozen very frequently so that's why they think of something that it is something is required so that uh, the water doesn't get freeze or get boiled very easily if the water boils then it is going to uh, it is going it, it is going to be quite hazardous for the cavity in which the water is flowing because when the water boils it the volume of it increases and hence it may burst the whole uh, uh, whole cavity system so basically what engine coolant is uh, is the mixture of water plus antifreeze in up in an appropriate proportion uh, the proportion will be suggested by your own uh, user manual so you have to study the user manual for that but uh, uh, it is the mixture of water and antifreeze so what actually antifreeze is? Most, most, some people say antifreeze is the Indian coolant only but some people say yeah, anti, uh, antifreeze is the chemical which is protecting the water from freezing or uh, for, from boiling. So antifreeze you, most of the time the Indian coolant is seen to be in the color of green, yellow, or pink, orange and th these kind of colors and uh, uh, the chemical uh, chemically this antifreeze is the alcohol uh, named as ethylene glycol but uh, in the in today's scenario uh, the, uh, the the alcohol has been changed and more efficient but costly alcohol is used that is propylene glycol this uh, propylene glycol, glycol has better efficiency and better heat conducting capacity so that's why it is more favorable to be used on the other hand why uh, what why these antifreeze are used is that uh, before using this antifreeze the water used to boil at 0 degree celsius and uh, oh sorry 100 degree celsius and it, it it starts to freeze at 0 degree celsius but uh, when the, when the changes are observed uh, in water and 50% coolant the 50% coolant uh, coolant will be freezing at minus 37 degree celsius so you can see the water which is which is uh, freezing at zero degrees Celsius now it will be freezing at minus thirty seven degrees Celsius so it, it gives a great difference uh, so that's why the engine will be work easily work, will be working easily at uh, a minus uh, in the range of zero to thirty minus thirty seven degree also and also uh, uh, the normal water boils at hundred degrees Celsius but uh, when this coolant is mixed it is going to burn it, it is going to boil at uh, from 240 degrees celsius to 270 degrees celsius so in this way uh, this the boiling point has been increased so it can sustain more heat and it can take out it can extract more heat from that uh, uh, from the from the engine or components without getting boiled so this is how this antifreeze is going to help uh, in sustaining uh, in, in the Indian coolant board in the Indian coolant cavity I would like to tell you some more advantages of this antifreeze antifreeze or this alcohol the main ad, uh, the, the advantages are like it, it is preventing the cavity from corrosion 
बिकॉज नॉर्मल वाटर इज यूजली यूजली फाउन टू बी कोरोडिंग द बॉडी बट वेन एंटीफ्रीज इज यूज देन इट इट प्रोटेक्ट इज फ्रॉम कोरोजन एंड ऑल्सो अदर थिंग इज इट इज प्रोटेक्टिंग इट कूल एंड फ्रॉम फ्रीजिंग इट इज प्रोटेक्टिंग द कूल एंड फ्रॉम बॉयलिंग एंड वन थिंग मोर इज दैट uh it 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 is a very good conductor of heat so in that way it is also helping uh, it, uh also helping this uh, coolant to extract more heat and more frequently so in this way this uh, antifreeze is helping uh, uh most of the people ask us uh, why why don't we use the 100% of the antifreeze i would like to tell you that antifreeze uh, is only catalyzed by water If you are using directly this ethylene glycol inside the engine, then it won't be able to perform that well when uh, when uh, uh, as that when mixed with 50% of the water. So <clears throat> when the results are observed uh, with this antifreeze and the uh, and the and the whole coolant, what happens is uh, this antifreeze is showing the properties similar, quite similar to the water. so that's why it, it was suggested why not to use 50% mixture or or any other mixture that is as suggested by your uh, user manual so the mixture is quite uh, uh, is required to be made because it is going to perform well only then so i think this is whole about indian coolant if you still have any doubts or any queries you can please feel free to ask me in the comment section below you can ask me questions on instagram or facebook because i frequently answer questions or over there so i hope you guys will be asking something because uh, i will be waiting for your questions thanks a lot guys for watching keep watching keep sharing keep supporting guys thanks a lot